Well, good morning, everyone. My name is Sean Mitchell. I'm one of your county commissioners, chairman from District 2. Thank you for all, all of you for joining us today for the unveiling of our latest addition to the John B. Parks Sporting Complex. I'd like to recognize the, sport, uh, the Parks and Recreation Department for all their hard work for coordinating this year-long venture with National Fitness Campaign Group and for their partnership in giving us a $30,000 grant to supplement the cost of building this 210,000 fitness court. This 1,024 square foot open facility is comprised of seven stations. It's an open air facility, it is ADA accessible, and it's adaptable for all users, giving them a full body workout. We're committed to building additional fitness court systems at our other regional parks within the county to, pro to promote healthy physical activity within our communities. And right now I would like to in invite Willie Redden, the Interim uh, Assistant Parks and Recreation, who will provide more details about this project. Thank you all for being here. Willie, thank you. Thank you for all you do. Yes, sir. Absolutely. Okay. Commissioner Mitchell, thank you very much for those kind words and that introduction. Appreciate that. Um, first off, I'd like to just apologize for um, having you all out on such a nasty morning. I wish it was, uh, you know, I wish it was more sunshine, but I guess we'll, we'll make the best of it. We'll just go ahead and just power right through it. Um, good morning. Uh, my name is Willie Redden. I'm the Interim Assistant uh, Director of Parks and Recreation. I'd like to thank you all for joining us this morning uh, as we proudly celebrate the grand opening of our latest addition to the John B. Park Sporting Complex a seven station open air fitness court. Before I begin, I'd like to take a moment to recognize our parks department for putting the finishing touches on the facility. They did install the gravel sidewalk and the engineered wood fiber uh, that you see around the perimeter. So I want to thank them for that. I would also like to introduce our very own communications manager, Mr. Flynn Fidgen. He's been kind enough to volunteer his time this morning <laughs> to demonstrate a few of the exercises at the end of my presentation. At least that was the plan. Right. <laughs> yes, I don't know if we're actually gonna be able to do that, but uh, he was kind enough to volunteer his time and we certainly appreciate that. Um, this project has been in the works for a while now and the county is extremely excited to bring this fresh, modern, world-class fitness court to our community. This project was funded with the help of a $30,000 grant from the National Fitness Campaign and the balance from our parks impact fees. This court was designed and built by the National Fitness Campaign, a San Francisco company that partners with cities, schools, corporations, and design firms to fund and build outdoor fitness courts to promote healthy lifestyles within communities. This 1,024 square foot open air wellness center is comprised of seven stations that can accommodate all fitness levels from beginners to special forces training. The, this fitness court provides users with a full strength challenge by leveraging their own body weight to provide a complete total body workout experience. It is designed to develop our mobility, flexibility, and balance of core muscles. Each individual exercise allows for stationary or body weight movements such as lunges, squats, push-ups, and pull-ups. Created with all ages in mind, the fitness court is ADA accessible and adaptable for all fitness levels. But you must be at least 14 years of age to use the equipment. New users can download the fitness court app, which provides a coach in your pocket style platform that transforms the outdoor gym into a digital, digitally supported wellness ecosystem. The app entitled Fitness Court is available for iOS and Android users. This fitness court is the first of five courts scheduled to be built over the next four years at our other park locations throughout the county. John B. Park Sporting Complex was chosen as the first pilot site due to its high visibility and usage. Next year, we plan to add a shade structure, providing more protection from the elements, 
Future developments would include incorporating other different types of exercise platforms along with a quarter mile track that will surround this entire area. The National Fitness Campaign developed and trademarked the seven station system in 2012, hoping to inspire municipalities to transform public spaces into community fitness hubs. There are currently 200 active fitness court locations across the country and the campaign will reach a total of 500 cities and schools by the end of 2023. As I conclude my presentation, we would like to remind you all that this court comes with a message, and that message is simple. Stronger together. As we work to enhance a healthier lifestyle and strengthen our bodies, we should also make a conscious effort to work and enforce our minds, our moral values, and our relationships within the community. Upon leaving here today, we invite you to join us for a photo opportunity against the back wall of the, of the, of the fitness court, which proudly displays our message. And we ask that you kindly take this with you in your hearts today and every day, our message of Stronger Together. We are stronger together as a nation, we are stronger together as a community, and we are stronger together as a people. We are stronger together. Thank you. Thank you very much. One, two, three. Got it. Thank you. Do you want to do one more?